to avoid this, clean your moderator. We get a lot of people that don't look after their moderators at all. They will clean their guns, um, but the moderators are kind of put on the back burners a little bit. Um, and as a result, if I can grab this gun just behind me here, um, you can get quite big issues with the thread on the end of the rifles, obviously to where the moderator is screwed onto. Um, you can see on this one here, it's been neglected and it's got rust around the thread and then the crown at the top um, does start to kind of wear away and then the moderator won't be on right, it might not be perfectly concentric because of course we don't want to lose accuracy, the gun would be a lot less accurate. So a good way of avoiding that is with proper maintenance of the moderators. There's obviously various different moderators on the market, some are enclosed units like these two here and then others are kind of made up of the baffles or, or housing. Now a really simple way of doing it is, is just spraying oil down the moderator, putting it aside and letting it condense. We are slightly biased here because we <laughs> sell and are the distributors of um, these moderators, Freer and Devic. They have uh, a really, I mean, they just make it simple, to be honest with you. Once you've screwed it off the gun, if I just take this part here, um, you are just taking the housing apart, not any of the baffles. You can get in right to the baffle stack. You would do the same again. You'd spray oil down, get some good coverage on throughout the moderator. Um, and then you could get something like one of these, which is just a simple basic nylon brush. Um, and you can really just get into, into the gubbins of it and clean it thoroughly in the thread as well, if you can see in there. Get into the thread and just make, make, make life easy. Treat it well. It is metal after all, as is the end of the gun. And it will give you better longevity on all of your kit, which we all want.